Well, I think when you, you know, it's such an honor to be listed amongst some of the greats that have ever played here. There's so many uh, players that poured a lot of blood and sweat into the program. And to when I know when I broke it, it was such, such an honor to have the to be in the company of such other legends along Wake Forest women's basketball. And now to have the chance to coach the young lady that's going to be our, our scoring leader. You know, it's just, it was, it was a really special uh, day for us. It was, a, you know, it's an honor to have an opportunity to, to be the coach uh, and to just watch Erica blossom into such a great player and arguably our best player in the history of the program. I had already been pretty hot from the free throw line, so I was like, these are going in and this is it. And, uh, so I left my hand up a little longer. <laughs> I think that was the best part about it. Uh, my mom usually is really good about making the games, but uh, to have like 50 plus other family members be there that normally wouldn't be able to see me play made it even uh, more special because they were able to see it. Coach Hoover was a great player here. She's a better coach, as I've said before. And um, to be able to be coached by her uh, as I broke the record uh, is pretty meaningful. You know, I think Dierica had a great perspective going into the season about it. She knew that she had a chance, but she also knew that the record was more than just about her. It was going to be about her teammates and this team and what we were able to do and, and that it was going to take every one of them to help her with that. It wasn't just about how many points she could score, but it was trying to do whatever the team needed to do to win games night in and night out. And this team has just stayed positive and, and really bought into the hard work it takes to win in this conference. And to see us um, reap the benefits of that in a, in a tight fault contest against the uh, Miami Hurricanes was, was a great opportunity for this young team to feel a little success and be able to build upon that. Uh, as Coach said, uh, we have great momentum going into the tournament. Um, we didn't get the Georgia Tech win, but we definitely played really hard and we're just gonna have to build off that. You know, I think we're playing great basketball. We do. De we definitely have a sense of urgency about us. Uh, the key for us going forward is we have to have the best of all 13 players, and there's three players in there that can't even play a minute on the floor, but they impact us every day, and we have to have all 13 giving their, the best version of them that they possibly can, and when we do that, we're a very dangerous basketball team.